the, I think the biggest goals we want to change the the, um, the the emission trading scheme. We we want to bring the 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 level of of CO2 emissions uh, that that the, these big polluters are allowed to emit every year. We want to bring this level down, and it's it's going down already, but it has to go down much faster um, to comply with the the Paris agreements. Quite soon we, we started thinking about, uh, uh, about the idea of actually buying emission rights ourselves. And of course, uh, as, a, as, as a citizen, it's, if you just buy one or maybe even t 10 of, the, uh, of those emission rights, um, so what different, uh, difference does it make? But of course, it it's gets another, uh, it's another story if uh, maybe uh, thousands or hundreds of thousands or maybe even millions of Europeans would start buying these emission rights, then of course uh, something would happen. Um, then, then probably the price of an emission right would go up and that would make it much more difficult for the polluters to, uh, uh, to emit CO2. We were surprised when we started this project two weeks ago um, how many how many people jumped uh, on the on the train and, and and joined us in this campaign because it, it was even the, when we the first day when when our website went online we had two crashes because too many people started buying uh, these allowances we were really surprised about that but once you have paid some money for it you're a stakeholder in the system it's it then it also becomes your system you paid money for this uh, European allowance so you have the right to uh, to, to demand something from the system as well. We integrated this CO2 calculator um, into our website to, you know, ju just to, to give people also a, a little bit of an, an idea about, about CO2. You know, th that's actually also, I think, one of the uh, targets of this campaign, you know, to just um, yeah, to, to involve people and, and, and also to, to teach them a little more about, uh, about CO2 and, and what, it's, what it's really all about. We were really happy with the work of our designer, the, the way he uh, designed our, our logo and, the, and the, the artwork of the website, which I think which is extremely important to, 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 to get the right feel. So it's not just about involving people to, and get them to buy uh, the, the emission rights. No, it's, it's also about sending a, sending a strong signal to the, to the politicians um, to do something about it. And this joint venture uh, made, it, made it possible for us to reach, uh, to reach out and to, to, um, to get our message to, to a lot of people in the Netherlands and for Green Choice of course it was a, it, it was a very edgy campaign uh, to, um, to, to sharpen their profile as a green uh, company. Yeah. I think a lot of people are also getting involved because they, they feel that, that something has to be done um, we don't have time, any time to lose, so this kind of this feeling of urgency. Um, and maybe this is something we, uh, you have to think about uh, when, when you do a, a project ar around a nanotechnology. So where is the urgency? Why, why do we have to react now? What, what do you want from us? Uh, how, make it concrete. <laughs>